The GOAT, Dave Chappelle, a 2000 seat event gets shut down by the Cowardly Theater after Antifa terrorists, and I use that word with precision, got the event shut down. The dictionary, dictionary definition of terrorism is the use of or threat of violence in order to achieve a political outcome. Because they believe Dave Chappelle is their political adversary because he hates trans people, they use the threat of violence, shut down his comedy special, his event. 2,000 people have to be rerouted to another theater and the feds allow this to take place. We are living in a terroristic state where one faction of the population believing themselves to be the morally superior and virtuous members of their own society. They don't attribute our society because we are the evil patriarchy that demonizes trans people and all of the minorities that exist in the world. This is their vision of the planet. And yet they are able to act with such impunity that they get the greatest comedian, perhaps of all time, to have his event shut down. And the feds do zero about it because basically these are the allies of the woke acolyte allies of the Democratic Party that helped dislodge Donald Trump from the presidency. When they talk about January 6th riot, what about the 529 insurrection where Antifa burnt down a White House guard tower, set fire to St. John's Church, and had to have the president of the United States move to a bunker? Yet do we investigate this. All of the injured police officers, we do not dare look at this. Merrick Garland, you allow these people to act in impunity and you are going to see a whiplash. You are going to see eventually people get tired of it and take guns out into the street and deal with these people severely. And I'm not advocating for that. I do not want that to happen. We must be a society with a rule of law that is imposed equally on everybody because that is the definition of equal opportunity. The equality under of the law is one of the greatest things that the English common law has brought to the planet. This does not exist in, for example, Sharia law, the very far extreme version of Islam that seems to dominate certain swaths of the world, where if, for example, if you kill a local respected Muslim, you are going to be dealt with far more severely than if you were to end the life of a Jewish woman. This is just a fact. They do not treat things equally. But Merrick Garland, of course, is putting all of his FBI agents, all of his Department of Justice on investigating parents who stand up to the school boards because these are the terrorists in their mind and being investigated as such, yet they let these Antifa thugs cancel an event by Dave Chappelle. And I am tired of it. And I demand that our authorities put their resources towards corralling these horrible people and their actions. Let's send them on a one-way ticket to their beloved communist utopia of North Korea. We will pay for these people to have their, to renounce their citizenship and pay for a one-way ticket for them to their final destination and get them the hell out of here. Because when you have people whose values jive so little and have so little overlap with most people, then they must be excised from the society. And this is the manner that I wish to do it. And if they don't agree, then we imprison them for their unlawful terroristic actions. Peace, blessings, thumb up the video, subscribe, hit the all notification bell and share the video if you enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Peace out.